Hello Libra, this is Soul. And Libra, this is your June 2019 Moonology Messages. It will be for Libra Sun, Libra Moon, Libra Rising Signs. Uh, before I begin, a quick FYI, um, before I begin your messages, Libra, I'm not going to be doing the three-day forecast um, along with your Moonology Messages uh, because it's just um, I decided that it creates uh, confusion. So, you know, I apologize for any inconvenience for anyone. Uh, it's something I started last month and I thought maybe I could, you know, follow through and do it. But there's just too much confusion going on. And some people who don't even look at the uh, Moonology messages don't even realize even after me, you know, putting up a thumbnail saying that there's a message, excuse me, a messages or a message, a three day forecast in there. So I think I just need to uh, abort that that ideal and uh, possibly I might come up with something else later on but who's to say but anyway selecting three cards uh, getting into your messages here reading the uh, messages straight out of the textbook not incorporating any of my intuitive uh, impressions to the cards that are being selected for you Libra all right so let's begin see what's coming up it's just messages for guidance and inspiration to help you along your path, your journey, or whatever. All right, so the very first card that is, is uh, has been selected for you, uh, Libra, is your commitment is being tested. Now, this has been selected for Libra, not Libra, but Leo. First quarter moon. Okay, so we have the first quarter moon. Your commitment is being tested. So let's see what it says. There could be some challenges coming your way, but they're just the universe's way of testing you. The first quarter moon calls for you to face any hurdles with confidence. What do you actually think is possible? If you believe you can do it, then you probably can. If you spend your life affirming that something is too big for you to surmount, it probably is. See how that works? Do you believe your dreams will come true or have you secretly already given up? Showing some commitment now will help you move towards your desired outcome what you believe to be true is true for you so believe in yourself that is the first quarter moon your commitment is being tested and that's your first message there libra next message up is you are good enough and this is the full moon in virgo you are good enough so let's see what the message says about you are good enough It's time to be really honest with yourself and understand what's led you to ask your question. Have you been humble to the point of being self-effacing? Humility is good, but it can go too far. And drawing this card suggests you may be underrating yourself. You don't have to be flash, just quietly certain that you are good enough. At the other end of the scale, you also need to honestly answer this question. Have you been too picky? The full moon in Virgo card needs some truthful answers. Once you've given them, it should be easier to see how you got where you are. Your next step should then be more obvious to you. Pay attention to the details. Hard work brings results. That is the full moon in Virgo. You are good enough. All right. So your final message here for you, Libra, is meditate and con contemplate new moon in Pisces. Okay, so this is another card that's not been numbered. New Moon in Pisces. Oh, okay. It would be at the <laughs> tail end. Yeah, very last one when you know it. Meditate and contemplate. This card speaks of dreams and romance, of soulmates and poetry. It suggests there's a new start coming your way that's connected to a matter that leaves you feeling somewhere between having your head in the clouds and being a totally and being in a totally altered state. There could be confusion and disappointment. If that's what you've had before, that's what you're expecting. 
However, if you're on to a good thing, wish hard because the words of your soul and your heart could bring could help bring about the manifestation of your dreams. If all that sounds a little wet and watery, then that's Pisces for you. This is the last sign of the Zodiac and the new moon in Pisces cards can suggest a last ditch chance to make your dreams come true. All right. Meditate and contemplate new moon in Pisces. So this is your message, Libra, for the month of June. Um, My apologies for (laughs) having to pause there and find the, the, you know, the message to go along with this card that was selected for you. But anyway, these are just, you know, inspirational messages and guidance, like I stated before. Libra, please be safe. Uh, Always emphasizing that safety. I'm sending you out quite a bit of love and light your way. Until I talk to you again, Libra, be well. Bye.